I would say when you sit back and you look at how DC has been changing and elevating and even being gentrified, what are your thoughts on that? Like just seeing the city change in front of you? Everything gotta change. You gotta you gotta learn to adapt. That's one of the main keys to survival. Did you see uh, Marion Barry making any impact while he was in DC? Like growing up? I don't think I was looking at politics back then like that. And I don't even think like like even local politics now. Like you now I feel like you see I can see the damages done to by polit politicians, but like I'm fucking hate the ta traffic lights and the fucking camera lights and the fucking speed limit being 25 miles per hour and you used to be able to get from one side to uh, DC in 15 minutes to the other side and now it's like 40 minutes. Like it takes me 30 minutes to get from Northeast to PG. Like that don't make no sense. So I definitely see changes more so now. Uh, what was it like knowing that Dolan wanted to meet you? Dolan? Yeah. Oh, he didn't even, he didn't even know who I was when I met when I first locked in with Dolan. He was uh he was sending beats and Fat Trail email, and Boozer gave me Fat Trail email to get beats because they was already had producers they was fucking with. They never used that email, so I was just. Using Dolan shit out of there type shit. All right, so I got I got these five random questions, right? They just to see what your mindset is, right? The first one is, can you speak on how important it is to be original and to stick to your own sound? Oh yes, yeah, that's especially being a creative that I am. Like that's the only thing that's important in this world is creating something of your own. Other than that, you got nothing, you didn't even exist. You don't create something original. Children, music, art, something that speaks through the years. Other than that, you just, you didn't even exist. Um, all right, so this is the last one. You getting, uh, what kind of, should the should the best mumbo sauce be? The the, the barbecue joints. So like burgundy. Yeah, the burgundy barbecue joint. Not the ketchup joint and not the hot sauce, sweet sour, sweet and sour, duck sauce joint. Them joints too watery. The ketchup joint's cool for the for French fries so you do it right. But the barbecue joint I like the best when you just doing it all the gavel around. So who the best carry out there? Ain't no carry out. Ain't, ain't none of that shit no more. Alright, so what the carry out you used to go to? The joint in my hood. The closest ones, you know, you everybody gonna claim they local shit they best because that's all you go to. The fuck going from one side of town to eat some Chinese food to the next side of town. You could claim what's right there for you. Like, ain't nobody claiming that shit. Nobody eating that shit. They don't respect their own food. They don't respect our food. They don't respect shit. I ain't fucking with that shit.